Okay, I'm back. Uh, I did a lot more exploring here, and I actually found the third clue, which basically just said, head up to there. Um, and now, I managed to make my way on top of this building here, because I wasn't really sure where to go next, and I noticed this lapis structure. I'm not entirely sure where to go, but I guess we'll find out. Oh, it's a staircase. Alright. Where does this lead, though? There's some pigos. Pikmen. Not Pikmin. Pigmen. <laughs> now, what is up here? A single lapis, or a couple lapis blocks. And that seems to be it. Did this have, did this have a purpose to it? Maybe if I go to the center and check out what those lapis blocks are doing? Because otherwise I have no idea. Uh, okay, there's some light. That's nice. If I mind this. I really don't see a point to that. I guess this was just a red herring. Do I have to get across to there, maybe? I wonder if there's anything on top of this. Can I dig up? Oh, apparently not. Well, then the question remains, how do I get to the rest of the islands? I mean, there doesn't seem to really be a route that connects them. Hmm. I guess bridging will be my best bet for now. I'll go see if I can make a bridge that'll connect something. Ah, the most beautiful bridge known to man. Let's cross it. <laughs> Alright, so this is that dirt and lava island that I saw earlier. Seems to be right below the starting one. And there's a little glass bridge. That's cool. Let's see what kind of spawners are over here. Because I know there's going to be spawners. Or... Will there be spawners? I guess not. Okay. Ah, uh, that leads down there. Hmm. The epic loot area. We got some water here. That's nice, I guess. The trouble with this area, the reason why it, one reason why it's harder than the other clouds, is that in the other clouds, if you fell off, you would land on the ground and be able to get your stuff back. In this, it's just nether void below, making it uh, considerably harder. Now let's see what's in here. Clouds, tears. Aw, poor clouds. Don't cry. Don't spawn creepers either. Spawning creepers is much worse than crying. Didn't you hear what I said before, Cloud? Come on. Don't be like Cloud from Final Fantasy. You shouldn't cry. Because, <laughs> I mean, he cries a lot. No. <laughs> Alright, now let's see which one do I want to go to first. Let's head up this precarious glass staircase going at a strange angle with lots of lag, apparently. Okay, definitely don't want a gas shooting at me. But what am I going to do to take care of this? I could go down there. Might be a good option. But I don't think the gas can actually see me right now. So I'm just going to cross this, because... I want to be bold. Oh god, that's void. Uh, note to self, don't hit the zombie pigmen. Oh, pleasant. Ooh. Splash potions of strength, regen, and damage, as well as 16 bookcases. Oh god. Jeez, he scared me for a sec. I'll take the enchantment table, because that's pretty nice. But I don't really have anything I need to enchant right now, so I'll leave it be. What a nice little enchanting outpost. It's a shame I'm not going to use it. And we can actually kind of ride these tiers upward to get to higher altitudes and new challenges. And hopefully the ghasts don't mess any of that up. I wonder what's at the very top. Well, I guess I'll find out. There seems to be some coal over there. Kind of odd, but whatever. That's where I really want to go, because that's where that monument piece was, according to those notes. Which is what I have been searching for. 
Up here we have... Nothing special. Just kind of a cloud. That's a skeleton spawner over there. That's not even my cloud, though. Hey, hey, you, you get off of my cloud. Alright, so it looks like that's the cloud we want to be at. Not this one. That cloud has all the fun. This one sadly gets none. <laughs> okay, uh, before I head up there, because that's probably going to be the end of this area, let's go this way. And to get down to this cloud, we can just head in the water and use that. These zombie pigmen are making me so nervous. Jeez, the nether is annoying. Ooh, efficiency axe, stake, and wart. Alright, cool. I don't know why he bothered to put in a double chest, though. I mean, he could have fit that in a single one. Let's jump in and not fall. Because falling would suck. Let's just put it that way. And there is still that epic loot in the middle that I'm going to get, just not right now. But we're really close, actually. We've come a long way in this Cloud Canyon, and I don't intend to give up now. Alright, strange ladder. So far, nothing really too uh, hostile in terms of en uh, enemies here, yet. Ooh. We have a diamond box with lots of diamond ore and... Creepers. Had to be creepers. Oh. God, that scared me half to death. Jesus Christ. Oh, God, I was too busy looking at the pretty diamonds to focus on the exploding green mounds of death coming my way. Jeez, that scared me. Damara. That spawner was mean. <laughs> Alright, well, now that I have a half heart attack. Let's continue upwards. Oh, hi, zombie pigman. Oh, you're drowning. No. Don't drown. Get out of the water. Poke your head out. Dude, you're going to die. Come on, you can make it. Oh, no. Zombie pigman. What a tragedy. We will forever mourn his loss. Ah. <laughs> All right, what have we here? Creeper spawner is just what I didn't want to see. Oh crap, wither, wither skeletons. Another thing I didn't want to see. Luckily my sword has smite four on it, which is actually incredibly useful in the nether. Wow, I'm hungry. Okay, let's eat some stuff. Fast travel. Down. Yeah, that is true. You can do that. Alright, let's head in here and see if there's anything terrible that we can die from. Got some or at least one creeper spawner. That's that's fun, right? And blazes. Let's run. Alright, let's take a step back and look at this. Hmm. What should I do? Ah! Well, I suppose let's... Let's just go inside. Ah, there's the blaze spawner. Not anymore! Alright, so this is that little house he was talking about. Oh, yeah. Huh. We're in the nether. Don't use beds in the nether, kids. Was this where he wanted to go up, or was... Ah, there we go. Let's just place some ladders. And come on up. Aha! Here we have it. The forgotten piece. What? When I said there was only one monument piece in this place yet, I actually f left... I actually forgot about another that reads very close to the bedrock tower. Enter the mossy ruins inside the hollow cloud and receive the second monument piece in this area. Okay. I guess cobwebs are the monument piece? Was cobweb a monument piece? I don't think it was. So what's this? Why is this? I mean, I guess I'll bring the book with me. And I already got the sponge. Is the cobweb the monument piece? I, I don't know. I'll find out. I guess. This is confusing. Okay. Ooh, fancy. Wooden potions. I've got a lot of potions, actually. I mean, these stackable potions are a really valuable resource because they don't 
they have all the benefits of potions without taking up valuable inventory space. So I can have one inventory slot that gives me the benefit of eight health potions, which is really nice. Let's see, where does this lead? Oh yeah, this is fast travel, but it also can lead into the void. Huh. Fun. Alright, let's get out of here. Well, that was nice. Okay, that wasn't really that hard. The real challenge is just finding it. That's the place that's going to be tough. And I'm going to get some of this stuff back to my base before going at that. And maybe I'll make... Nah. Alright. Yeah. We need... God damn it, Gast. I'm going to go back to my base and drop some stuff off. So, like I was saying before, I actually hadn't realized how effective swords with smite on them are in the nether. Because, I mean, you've got... It's effective on zombie pigmen. So, that's one really important thing. Where is this Gast? There he is. Hi. Bye. So you've got... Ugh, damn it. You've got zombie pigmen. So that's definitely really useful in defending yourself. Don't hit him. <laughs> and you've got... Wither skeletons, as well as the skeleton spawners that I've been finding here. And the only enemies that you really can't handle with smite swords are ghasts, which you need bows for, and blazes, which bows are really helpful for. So... In terms of using a sword, Smite is actually not a bad enchantment. So now it's time to go down here. And this makes me nervous. Because you can just tell how dangerous this is. Uh, I need to get rid of those gas spawners first and foremost. Ah. Uh, so what's my plan here? Uh, this path looks like it actually ends there. So I think a better way to get down there would be going up to here, and instead just uh, bridging, or not bridging, sorry, walking down to that uh, water stream, so I can make my way over there. Let's do that now. Lots of lava. It's pretty. <laughs> the zombie pigmen swimming in the lava. Well, you know what? I wonder what's on top of this cloud. Maybe it's something interesting. Let's find out. Because I find it weird that there's these two lava streams, but then there's only one water stream. It's kind of strange. But, whatever. Let's see, is there anything up here? Uh, hmm. By the looks of it, no. Seems to just be... Ah! Get away. You're a jerk. Guest sniping, it's fun. Let's see, is there anything like in here, I wonder? Probably not. If you fall down through here, what do you get? Not good things. Alright, now let's, let's head down this water and see if we can do anything with it. <laughs> now, these gas spawners are going to be dangerous. Like, there's no doubt about that. Ah, shit. Luckily, there's not many zombie pigmen in this area. Is this silverfish? No. So I can just kind of shoot at things without really having to worry about setting off the zombie pigmen's anger tag. This guy might prove to be a problem, but nothing too terrible. Alright, so this is actually going really well. I'm not really getting ambushed by anything and no ghasts are spawning, so that's great. Ah, oh, there's blaze spawners. Why would I expect any different? This bow has punch on it, which is pretty cool. But what do we get here? Whoa! Alright, so some cool diamond tools. Smite one. Smite one, are you kidding me? No. I don't want smite one. Smite one's for losers. Uh, okay. So, I think that does it for this area. Or, yeah. I don't think there's really anything left to do in the entire cloud, uh, canyon. I had to remember the name for a second. Shit, 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 shit. Damn it, Blaze Knockback. Taste some knockback of my own. Alright, there we go. I don't think there's anything left to do here in the, in the cloud canyons. So, next 
I think I'm going to go return this stuff to my base and then head into the other area of the nether, which was that minecart section, which could lead to two different areas. And I'm not sure which one of those I should do first, so I guess I'll just decide on that. Anyway, see you guys when I'm there.